Hey, what is up everybody? It is PJ here and we are back to doing another kind of short vlog. Um, I decided to kind of restart this whole thing. I've been doing some blogging, some very, very small blogging recently. And I figured I still want to do some videos. I want to take, you know, I want to go to some places, some parks, travel, take some pictures. I don't normally like to take pictures of me anyways. So what I'll be doing is I'm going to be using the camera to basically take a picture of everything else that's around me and see, capture moments of everything that I kind of enjoy. That includes videos with my mom, um, the animals that I see around the road and stuff like that. So I decided to go ahead and purchase an actual camera. Mirrorless Canon M50. So I'm actually taking this video with my phone. I'm using the front camera right now and then what I'll be doing is I'm going to be changing this the camera that I'm using to the back and I'm going to be doing some comparisons with how my iPhone 7 Plus uh, compares with the Canon M50. I did get the video creator kit so it is going to have a microphone on there and I'm also using the onboard microphone on my phone. I haven't I purchased a lavalier microphone, but I kind of lost it when I moved apartments, so I don't know where it is. But yeah, let's go ahead and switch cameras like right now. Ooh, okay, so this is the back side of my camera, iPhone 7 Plus. I've actually never really taken pictures or selfies with the back camera, so it's kind of useless for me, but it is actually a pretty good camera. Uh, it's supposedly good at low light with the telephoto lens. This is the 7 Plus, so it's the first generation basically with the two cameras on the back. Um, anyways, this is the audio at arm's length. This is the video quality at arm's length. And this is also 4K. So, 4K at 30 frames per second. So, should be pretty good quality. I've just never actually used it because I can't see. I can't tell if I'm actually in the frame or out the frame. I don't know. So let's go back to the regular front facing camera and let's do the comparison next. In all honesty, you know, this ash this camera is actually pretty good if I can just figure out how to kind of like hold it without kind of making it seem so awkward. Um, I actually really, really like the camera on my phone. I've never actually changed iPhone since I purchased this back in like 2000 something, you know, when the iPhone 7 came out. Uh, I actually have a lot of memories on this phone. I got the 128 gigabytes, but it's actually filled with pictures and videos of previous years. So, and I don't really want to use this camera for vlogging anyway, so I've been using like my uh, generic webcam that I purchased from the Philippines. So my video qualities were kind of really crappy too, like the, it's supposedly HD but the quality of the lens or just the webcam itself is just not that great so it's kind of really bad quality and I, on top of that i also didn't have a microphone so i've been using like my iphone lavalier connected over to my phone and try to kind of like mix those audios up and i also got a condenser microphone which at the apartment that i used to live wasn't very user friendly because everything was getting picked up and it was just very very sensitive it's good but too sensitive for a person who lives in an apartment and with very thin walls so um back to the point of this video which i totally forgot because a woman was passing by and i'm like i got distracted oh my gosh i totally just missed it there was like a lot of geese behind the car and I couldn't pull my phone fast enough and pull the video fast enough in order to capture them. But they were like chasing each other behind the car and I saw them on the side mirror. And then as soon as I poked my head out of my window, they like flew away or ran away. Didn't even know they can fly so fast or run so fast. But I can't see them now. Oh, I can see them. Let's go try the zoom on this phone. Mm -hmm. Oh, can you see them? Yes, you can. That's the zoom. There they are. They were chasing each other just like that when they were behind my car. This, my hands are so very shaky. I hope the stabilization thing is working. But yeah, things like this, I kind of want to capture. Earlier this morning when we were here, um, around like 8.30 in the morning, I know it's so crappy. It's Sunday. I shouldn't be awake that early. But I saw like a couple of them 
showering in the puddle or like washing themselves in the, in the, in the puddle and I was like just watching I'm creeping that way I know but they're so entertaining and they're so funny because we, we I literally saw one like get left behind by their flock and he's just like sitting there like he's lost or something and he just sat there literally uh, anyways, I think it's a little weird. People can see me looking that direction and there's somebody there. So, yeah. Okay, so basically, I'm gonna be starting, uh, I guess, a new name for this YouTube channel instead of just PJ or JK Gaming. This is gonna be called uh, This Is J. And the blog is gonna be called This Is J Pinion. Just because I kind of wanna not really voice my opinions out but you know just to kind of like think out loud and kind of like process my thoughts in a different way than just hearing my voice in my head talk to myself over and over and over i think it'd actually be better to kind of like get some feedback from people um the first couple of blog posts that i have on there my friend had actually already responded with some very very deep and insightful um feedback uh I'm actually definitely reading it although it's very long I haven't really gotten that far but you know the first half of the email I think was pretty good and I'm considering that I actually you know following all of that and if for anybody else who wants to actually do the feedback and comments and get in touch I will definitely read those too and I'll probably try to respond in another vlog or another um, blog post there's just so many things in life right now that's kind of like happening and there's just too many things happening all at once it's too fast it's hard to journal it out because journaling or writing just takes too much time and i think videoing things just is much faster it's more accurate and 10 years from now five years from now it's something i can rewatch and you know kind of see how far i've progressed and how far i've grown and all the challenges that i've been through it's easier to kind of see and watch again I guess if you can say that from a video or from or read from from a blog post there's a lot more things that I can say when I type rather than when I write because when I write I get so distracted with my ugly penmanship and then I try to kind of like figure out what pen is nice to kind of hold and touch and all of that and it's just very distracting instead of just typing things out and seeing the exact same fonts the format that you want to see and all of that is a lot easier to get your thoughts out there <laughs> But yeah, since this video I think is going to be pretty long, I'm waiting for my mom to finally get done with lab work. I'm here in the parking lot. And I'm picking up the camera on Tuesday, April 15th. So I'll probably do another uh, comparison of the video quality from my iPhone and the camera. I just got deaf on one of my ears, tinnitus or something like that. I don't know. Maybe I'm just too tired. As you can tell, I'm very tired. My eyes are swollen. My face is swollen, it's a spring, there's pollens everywhere, it's allergy season, and I was out all day yesterday with my grandparents and my aunties and pollen everywhere, and I woke up with a headache and just tired and all of that, so I'm going to end this video here. Uh, if you want to see more of the comparison with a different phone, I actually have a Samsung S10, which I can actually also do a vlog comparison with the iPhone 7, just for the video quality and all of that. Is I mean, I know, I know it's something that probably people are wondering if they can use their phones to start vlogging with, and you definitely can. It's just, I don't want to be using my iPhone all the time because my battery drains so quickly. And I, and I also want to take off pictures of like, nature landscapes views and do some traveling stuff like that of just explore virginia you know i'm with my mom now she hasn't really been out of the house because of covid and i haven't really been out of the house because of covid and because i'm busy with work and i really really want to explore what's out there to see what's here what the state is you know things like that the history of it all it's a very interesting stuff so i thought maybe i'll take you know the people who watch this channel all along with me that's why it's not just gaming because my gaming stuff i can't really play right now because i only have a ps4 and my laptop has been so clunky and junky it's an msi and i need to upgrade some ram in order for me to actually do some video recordings on it and stuff so uh there's a woman passing by another car 
It's kind of embarrassing because I don't have tint in my car, but I guess I'm just shy that way. I don't know. It's weird because I'm actually uploading this video on YouTube where anybody can see anywhere around the world, but yet I don't not so comfortable with people seeing me actually doing the vlogging so i'm weird i know it's just it's a thing you know i'm a shy person if you can see the end product that's okay i guess because i've already done stuff look through this footage of what i'm okay for people to see and not just everything and that's kind of why it's so hard for me to keep this vlog consistent and on schedule because i'm just so weird that way like uh i don't want you know whatever but i think it's just i'm trying to work through that just get things out there work it out hit record and just post so i'll see you guys on the next one thank you guys for watching bye, -bye.